Hi guys, welcome back to a brand new video or if you have never seen my face before Hi, my name is Marloes and welcome to my channel In today's video I will be unboxing the No Make No Life box from January Not really sure if I'm pronouncing it correctly but the N, M and L box and this is basically a very cute little package filled with Korean and Japanese skincare and makeup. And I thought, let's switch it up for 2023 and unbox a completely different subscription box than I did in the past few years. So we have moved on to Japan and Korea with this one. Before we dive into all the items inside this No Make No Life box, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below if you haven't already and click the little notification bell so you will be updated on all the new videos I post on this channel. And while you're at it, also give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoy these unboxing videos. And without further ado, let's get into this video. So for this year, we are going to unbox the No Make No Life beauty box. And yeah, on the website, it basically says Japanese and Korean beauty box subscription. Enjoy a monthly beauty box containing eight to nine items of Korean and Japanese cosmetics and skincare. So yeah, I am super curious to find out all the cute stuff that they put in here. And let's just quickly move on with the first item. Right here I have the little flyer or booklet with all the information inside of it. Normally I would put this to the side because I don't like the spoilers. But yeah, a lot of the description will be unreadable for me. So I'm going to keep this with me so I actually know what item I am holding in my hands. But right here I see that the first box of 2023 for January is back to glow. So let's just grab the first item. Which looks like this. I'm immediately going to look what this actually is. I see that this is a Disney related product. The Twisted Wonderland product, but we are going to search in the little flyer what this is about. This is a Twisted Wonderland blush and lip cream color. The cream color can be used for blush to give a glossy cheek look and for lip to give a matte finish. The seven color assortment includes... Oh, I am not even going to be able to pronounce it but they have seven different colors of this one the blush and the lip cream comes in a compact size making it easy to carry and once the product is finished store small objects in the case so that is the first item let's quickly get it out of this packaging very cute that the first item is actually disney related because we all know very well that that matches me to the T, so all right. All right, this is what the little tin looks like. I have the Savannah Claw Edition, and the color looks pretty cute. Let's swatch this. Not really sure if this is going to be my shade of blush. Even though when I am spreading it out on my hands, it is actually a lot more subtle. So, not sure if the camera is picking this up, but it is a very, very subtle blushy color. And yeah, I actually like this a lot more than, than I first thought when I saw the color in the tin. But yeah, a cute little blush and lip combo. Next up, I have a little pouch by Salon Lady. So I guess this is something that has to do with your hair. Let's have a look. I am not really sure if I'm actually seeing this on here, but number eight says surprise care item. So I guess 
that this is the surprise item. An assortment of items to take care of you, of your bare self. Soap, mouthwash, bed powder and more. But I'm not really sure if that is what this is. So unfortunately I cannot tell you a whole lot about this. But it says Stella Lady. I see a lot of yeah, little icons, a hairdryer, some scissors, a bathtub. So I am guessing that this is some sort of hair mask, but I might need to look that up before I start using this. And this is actually an item that comes from Japan. And the previous one, the Twisted Wonder Balm Blush and Lip Color was also an item that comes from Japan. The next item is this cute little pink baggie. And what is inside of here? This is actually number five, also an item from Japan. This is the Club Bear Face Tinted Lip Essence. One coat gives your lips a natural shine and makes them look full and plump. Protect your skin with this gentle moisturizing product that will help lips feel silky smooth. The lip essence contains treatment care ingredients and moisturizing ingredients like shea butter, which prevents flaky chapped lips. Available in six colors, pink, rose, bordeaux, coral, red and brown. And yeah, I think that I have the pink one. But I'm not sure because I cannot read the packaging. But when I look right here in the little book, I think that I either have the pink or the rose version. But yeah... Very cute and also very handy with my dry ass lips because God knows that I really need this one. So we have a nice little lip care product. Moving on with this item. The only thing that I can read is Amateur. I'm always on your side and I see a little eye on there. So I guess this is some kind of eye color eye shade number six another item from japan the club select touch liquid eyeshadow club liquid eyeshadows create a striking eye look with secret pearls and powders formulated with eye care ingredients to keep your eye moisturized even during the winters when they can dry out due to heaters it adheres to the skin smoothly and doesn't clump in the areas or cause a sticky residue. Available in six colors. Natty Latte, Brown Ruby, Dusty Pink, Leo Terracotta, Ash Khaki and Beige Dress. And when I am looking at the different range of colors, I only see two colors that really caught my eye and this is one of them. The other one is more of a pinky shade. So once again, I'm not really sure which color I have because I cannot read it on this packaging. But yeah, this is a very nude kind of color. And I am actually pretty curious to find out how this looks in real life. So I'm going to open this one up to see what this is all about. So it actually looks like this almost looks like a little lip gloss and it almost matches my skin color not sure how well it's picking it up but i did a little swatch right here and i think this is actually very pretty as a base color or if you want to create the no makeup makeup look and it sits very nice on my skin so i am actually very excited to give this a try and see how i like these types of items Next up, I have a very cute bear greeting me on this packaging. And the thing I can actually read is the Fua Fua cleansing pad. That is something that is very useful. So I believe that this is one of those uh, cleansing pads that you can throw in the washing machine and use again. So let's look it up real quick. Also from Japan, the Fluffy Cleansing Pad. 
a soft and fluffy cleansing pad that removes makeup with warm water only. Gently wipe in a circular motion for the best results. Clean and dry the pad well before use. So this is exactly what I thought it was going to be. But the packaging just looks very cute with a little bear on it. And yeah, I'm just going to keep this closed because I have some others lying around. And we first need to wash this. So I am happy with this one because these always come in very handy. And the size is also a big plus. Moving on with the prettiest packaging ever because it looks like a night sky with stars. Love that. This is by Lulu Lun, One Night Rescue Face Mask, Glowing Skin, Special Care, <laughs> it says. And the back of it, I cannot read. Also an item from Japan, the Lulu Lun One Night Rescue Face Mask. UV rays, dryness and friction can cause damage to the skin's texture and cause it to lose its luster. This mask is an overnight intensive rescue mask that takes care of these problems and leads to radiant clear skin. A hot tip is using the remaining essence left over in the pack to treat your hands and neck. So this is actually a one sheet item so you can only use this one time. And yeah, they just give you a little tip to use the residue on your neck and your hands. But the packaging... I mean, if I would create a packaging, it would probably look something like this. So this is a very nice one to treat yourself in the evening. Also very curious to test this one out. We still have two items left in the box. Right here I have a box by the brand Milcott. This is a CICA or a Kika, not really sure how to pronounce it, Deep Intensive Balm with CICA 5 times complex skin protective membrane deep nourishing skin texture and the other stuff once again cannot read so this is the first item from Korea the Milkot C deep intensive balm the skin loving balm contains botanical ingredients that moisturize and protect the skin while also providing moisturizing care to problem areas while you sleep. The balm contains CICA powder, power or Kika power, I'm not sure, which helps to prevent rough skin caused by air pollutants and ultraviolet rays. Layer the product over rough skin areas for a more intensive care. So we got ourselves a nice little face cream. And when I am reading this little descriptive text, I guess this is a night cream, but I'm not really sure. But I really love nourishing and moisturizing items for my face in the evening. So this evening I will definitely test this one out to see how this works. And the final item is this little packaging right here, which has some aloe vera vibes going on. I do not see a lot on the packaging. Point back, sweet on you, you're the one. And it says 10 sheets. And that is basically it. So this is the second item from Korea. So the most of it is from Japan in this box, but we have two items from Korea. This is the point pack aloe. A point pack containing 10 lightly fragranced sheets of moisturizing ingredients that suit while it moisturizes. It can be used not only for the face, but also for dry elbows and knees. After cleansing and toning, Apply the product to areas of concern, such as the face, hand, feet, elbows and knees. Remove the pack after 10 to 15 minutes and gently blend any remaining serum on the skin. So you can actually have your own little spa moment with these 10 very cute aloe vera sheets. And yeah, you can just place some on your face or on some other areas that need a little bit more loving. So yeah, also a very handy item. 
it is all about the pampering with this product so I am definitely going to give this a try when I have one of my pamper nights and that were all the items inside the no make no life January box uh, my first impression is very good. These are some items that I have never seen before and I am very curious and excited to go and try out. In the previous years I have tested the goodie boxes and the style tone boxes and I've noticed that a lot of items just kept coming back. So I have a lot of products in my drawers right now that are just basically the same. And I was hoping that with this No Made No Life Japanese and Korean skincare and beauty box that I would just get some very exciting items that I have never tried or even seen before. And yeah, this first edition really gave me the impression that I made a good decision with this one. And also this box, just the packaging looks super cute. And also on the front there are a lot of cute little icons. So yeah, we are just going to test the No Make No Life box for this year and just see what comes our way from Japan and Korea. Let me know in the comments down below which item was your favorite or which item really caught your eye. Because I'm always very curious to find out what you guys think. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. It would mean a lot to me and you would also be helping me and this channel out a lot. Also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below if you haven't already and click the little notification bell so you will be updated on all the new videos I post on this channel. I post new videos every Saturday. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye!